In Herb's notebook, Gazette sports writer Herb Zerkowski gives us a tale of the tape on Stevenson. Well, I can tell you that he's 35 years old, which is somewhat old to be getting your first professional uh, world championship opportunity. Like a lot of fighters in this city, he was born in Haiti. He came to Canada at an early age. He was a fairly distinguished amateur fighter. Indeed, he represented Canada at the 2006 Commonwealth Games in Melbourne, and he won a silver medal there before turning pro. He got a very late start to boxing because he was in jail for 48 months on pimping charges, but he's worked hard at cultivating his image. He's very clean cut outside the ring, doesn't smoke, doesn't drink, doesn't fool around, party. As a professional, he has a record of 20 wins and one uh, loss. Uh, he has 17 knockouts. He's mostly known for as being a devastating puncher, and uh, usually if he hits you, it's lights out. He was, he was very cumbersome uh, when he turned pro. He didn't have a lot of technique. He, he relied on his punching power. Uh, he still does to a certain extent. But he certainly has worked on his skill and versatility over the last two years. He showed up at uh, the Kronk Gym in Detroit and worked under the legendary Emmanuel Stewart, who of course passed away last year. And Emmanuel Stewart certainly worked on, on honing Stevenson's skills, worked on his versatility, made him a more rounded fighter, a uh, more polished boxer. In the fight game, this is basically the chance of a lifetime for, for Stevenson. He can become a world champion.